Hi everyone, welcome to this video on behalf of the Stanford Medicine Division of GI and Liver Diseases Digestive Health Center. We'll be addressing some frequently asked questions about COVID-19 vaccine for patients with GI and liver diseases. First question, do you recommend the COVID-19 vaccine for patients with GI and liver diseases? The answer is yes. We recommend all patients with GI diseases, including inflammatory bowel diseases, celiac spru, and other GI diseases, as well as liver disorders like viral hepatitis, alcohol liver disease, fatty liver disease, and other chronic liver diseases to receive the vaccine. Patients with cirrhosis, in addition to those on the liver transplant waiting list, and patients who have already received the liver transplantation are also recommended to receive the vaccine as are individuals who are receiving therapy for inflammatory bowel disease. Question, is the vaccine effective in patients with GI and liver diseases? The answer is yes. The clinical trials have shown that both the Pfizer, BioNTech and Moderna vaccine are highly effective in preventing COVID-19. Those with inflammatory bowel disease were not included in the vaccine trials. However, they should still receive the vaccine. The clinical trials did include patients with liver diseases and we expect the vaccines to be effective in our patients. Is the vaccine safe in patients with GI and liver diseases? The answer is yes. The vaccine commonly causes mild side effects like arm pain, mild fever, fatigue and headache. Severe side effects are rare. If you have a history of severe allergies, especially an allergy for which you have to carry an EpiPen, then please discuss the safety of COVID-19 vaccine with your doctor. For all other patients, in general, this vaccine is considered safe. Next question. Will the vaccine be safe and effective in patients with IBD or those who underwent liver transplantation? The answer is yes. We expect them to be both safe and effective in these special populations. In general, other vaccines have been shown to be less effective in patients who have recently undergone liver transplantation, but we do not know if this is the case for COVID-19 vaccine. Even if it is less effective, we expect it to still offer protection against severe COVID-19 for patients who have undergone a transplantation or who are on immunosuppressive medications such as IBD. Who should not receive the COVID-19 vaccine? According to the CDC, these patients should not receive either the Pfizer-BioNTech or Moderna COVID-19 vaccine. Number one, immediate or severe allergic reaction after a previous dose of mRNA COVID vaccine or any of its components, including polyethylene glycol or PEG. Number two, immediate allergic reaction of any severity to polysorbate due to potential cross-reactive hypersensitivity with the vaccine ingredient PEG. Slide, which of the two vaccines should I take? Both Pfizer-BioNTech or Moderna COVID vaccine have been approved for use since they are both safe and effective. So please take whichever vaccine is offered to you. Leave it here, a list of our answers for frequently asked questions for COVID-19 vaccine in patients with GI and liver diseases. Thank you.